Hello, and welcome to Monday's Short Nerdy Day. I'm um, sorry, there's no intro. I'm still at my parents' house. My car is being fixed. Uh, it turns out there was a lot more, like I said, there was a lot more wrong with the car than I'd hoped it. So, I spent, uh, it's a nice, it's a nice two weeks with my parents. I mean, they're good people. I love them. You know, I love my whole family, so good people. But, okay, um, two things, because I gotta make this fast, because I'm using someone's laptop that I shouldn't be using, but had put out a video in a while, and the Instagram thing's not really working, so, um, two things. One, uh, saw Fast 7 yesterday. It's actually pretty amazing. It's a pretty good movie. I mean, there's outlandish action scenes, and... I think there was one line in the movie that Vin Diesel was like, listen, I have a line that needs to be in this movie, so here you go, put that in there. Uh, and, and that line is, the thing about street fights is, the streets fight back. That had to be in his line. It had to be in his line to where he was like, yeah, we're putting that in the movie because it, it's gorgeous. And I'm, I'm your main actor, so I'm pretty sure you're going to put that in the movie kind of thing. Uh, but other than that, it was a great movie. It had a lot of action in it, uh, a lot of awesome cars. That's fast. Fast and Furious movies happen. Um, I enjoyed it. It was very good. Um, but now that that's over with, uh, Age of Ultron is what? Oh, it's Thursday. Um, cannot wait for that movie because that movie looks so good right now. And, oh. Holy crap, it's 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 gonna be good. Can't wait to see it. I'm gonna go see it with uh Ben from Empire Comic Books and a couple of his friends and a couple of people that I know, so on the thirtieth, so midnight release. Well, not midnight release, but seven in the evening, so but um second thing, um free comic book day is this Saturday, guys. Um if you're looking for a great place to go to get free comic books, buy really cheap comic books, because there's going to be tons of sales going on, and have like a mini-con atmosphere, go to Empire Comic Books Vault on Fulton. Um, they're going to be having a great, um, it's just like a mini-con. There's going to be wrestling, there's going to be interviews, there's going to be podcasts, there's going to be free comic books. I'm going to be there. Uh, West Coast Avengers is going to be there. Ben is going to be there. I believe Good Day Sacramento is going to be there. So, it's going to be great. You need to check it out. Head on over to Empire Complex Vault on Saturday. Because it's going to be amazing and tons of fun. And then when you, you're done with the free comic books, go to the movie theater. See The Age of Ultron. If you've not already seen it Friday or Thursday night. So, I think I'm going to see it three times. Because I'm seeing it with Ben. I'm seeing it with some friends from work on a Friday. That's fun. And I think I'm going to see it again with some more friends on a Saturday. Hopefully by then, I will have my car fixed. And it'll be awesome. So, um, don't worry about the phone. Um, what else? Oh, the phone's throwing me off. No. Oh, um, I got this. Oh, hit myself in the house. I got this, uh, book Sunday. Um, I've been getting, like, the comic books from Ben, but then I kind of had kind of had to stop, and then I found out they had this, and so I had to buy it, and if you don't know what it is, it's the fade out, it's basically a, uh, it's a fifth, uh, I would say 20s, 20s, 50s era, uh, mystery about Hollywood actors, and it, it surrounds, uh, Hollywood actors, and there's, like, Vietnam War going on, and there's a huge mystery on who killed this uh, new girl who is supposed to be, like, the main star of the movie. But she gets killed, and no one knows why. And one of the characters knows, well, one of the characters found out that she was strangled. But he didn't want to tell anyone because uh, he's a writer. And the actual writer that has the great ideas is a drunk. And so he's so he got kicked out of the movie business. But now he's, let me try this word again, he's telling him what to write. I mean, he's writing it, and they're loving it, but they don't know. There's a lot going on. Let's just put it that way. 
a lot going on. It's pretty awesome. It's done by these guys right here. It's pretty amazing. Um, oh, haha. -ha. Let's read the back. Uh, it says here, Hollywood 1948, uh, an, a noir film stuck in an endless reshoots and writing played by an Played by nightmares from the war and up and up and coming starlets, Spectral's death and Monogol and his assistant sec security chief who will do anything to keep the cameras rolling before the studio system comes to a crash down, which doesn't it never does in these things where it's like oh it's gonna die but it never does and so yeah but it's I mean. It's pretty awesome, but you can't you can't look at this. Look, you see this art. This art's amazing. So yeah. So if you are looking for something to read, and you're done reading, uh, get this because this is pretty cool. Okay, I think that is all the time I have. Um, oh, Flash is on tomorrow. It's gonna be amazing. Uh, Gotham's on, and what? I can't see the time. What's the times? Gotham's gonna be on. And two hours. So if you're not watching, if you have nothing to do in two hours, go see Gotham, because it's also a good show, and all the good shows are coming to a halt. And I don't know what I'm going to do with myself, uh, because all these good shows are ending. So yeah, maybe watch Daredevil again. I don't know. Who knows? But I will see you all later. I thank you for watching. Uh, go ahead and hit uh, like and subscribe to this channel if you like it. Also, I'd like to thank Scary Comic Books for sponsoring this episode, and have a good night. Also, go to TVP Studios. There's great stuff there, too.